let's say you just finished recording some like hot, action-y, shooty, pew-pew, murderation goodness. Then you go back to check the recording. Incredible run. I got it all recorded. I'm going to publish it later and it's going to be brilliant. Audio levels are completely out of whack. Can you fix that? Not really. However, we can prevent that from ever happening again. Okay, this is OBS in default format. I have to admit it's been a long time since I've seen OBS look like this, but I'm assuming most of yours probably do. Maybe you've customized it a bit, but what do I have in this? We do have a game audio, soundtrack, and soundtrack? I don't know, source, yes, a game audio source, and a microphone for a source. Now what we wanna do is record those individually along with the video. How do we do that? Pretty straightforward. Under audio mixer, we're going to right click to bring up the advanced audio properties. Once we have that open, we can see the tracks on the far right side, one through six, spray and pray by default. Everything's everything's checked, just in case, just, just to make sure everything gets recorded. We don't need that, we don't. Track one is by default going to be your mix down. So that's what's gonna go out, you know, your my game audio, any other sources, and just send that out, be it to YouTube or Twitch. You kind of want to just leave that checked, just in case. Even if you're not streaming, it won't hurt anything. What we want to do is uncheck everything that we're not going to use. So I'm going to do that. And what I want to do is I want my microphone to be on track two. And I want my game audio to be on track three. So if I need to adjust my mic volume up or down in post, that's easy enough to do. Same goes for game audio. That's really everything we need to do. I will notice that my microphone is not set to mono. If you haven't done that, go ahead and check that box. We're going to close that menu and head to settings. This is really simple. Head to output. Let's see, what does the default say? Yes, that's good. Our recording format is MKV. That's Matroska. You can do MKV or move. I know for a fact. Multiple audio tracks, no problems whatsoever. So by default, you should be good to go. I don't have to give any education on that. We're gonna change our output mode from simple to advanced. And we're gonna head over to the recording tab. And by default, again, audio track one, it's the catch-all, it's everything's gonna get mixed down there. We don't wanna record that, nay. We're gonna record track two and track three. We'll tap apply. And would you believe that's it? because that's it. That's really all you have to do. Now, of course, you might want to go back and change your video settings, record, you know, audio, um, be it lossless, and I have videos on that if you want, but this will get you pointed in the right direction. But what would be the fun if I showed you how to do something without really testing it out? So let's record some test footage and take a look in KDN Live. Okay, here we are in KD and Live. I have two example videos, one with everything recorded on track one in OBS. I had the most incredible run. I got it all recorded. I'm going to publish it later and it's going to be brilliant. I can't wait. Can't wait to show you. Yeah, you see, that's a problem. Background noise overpowering my voice. And it's going to be brilliant. I can't wait. Can't wait to show you. Hope everyone had a good time. I can cut it up, but that just makes the problem louder. What to do, what to do. I'll tell you exactly what we're going to do. Let's have a listen to the same problem with our two-track solution. More importantly, this is an example of having a separate audio track. Yeah, that's right. We can go back and fix it. Let's get into it. Same problem, but now we can adjust the background, or well, the game audio and the VO. A separate audio track. Yeah, that's right. We can go back and fix it. That's a little Let's bit better. Into it. A little bit better. I think I'm going to pull the game audio down just a bit more and bring my voice up. Importantly, this is an example of having a separate audio track. Yeah, that's right. We can go back and fix it. Let's get into it. Brilliant. It's beautiful. Hopefully that's going to help you out. I know that will definitely save someone at some point a little bit of time. And um, if you don't have this set up currently with your OBS, go ahead and do it. You won't need it until you do. Thanks for watching. Thanks again to all the beautiful patrons who make these educational videos possible, supporting us over at patreon.com forward slash Linux Gamecast. And as always, quit worried about everything. Just get out there and make something awesome.